we have been getting so many comments lately about how we look so alike. And they just look so bad. We're just doing all we can with my hair and just doing so many treatments. So, eyelash routine. Everyone always asks for it. Hey guys and welcome back to another video. I feel like we're going to be taking a step back to like our old sort of style videos. Mm -hmm. Back when we used to do these all the time. But we thought 2021 we actually haven't done a proper glow up yet and we have both booked in to get our hair done at the exact same time. We're also just going to get a lot of other appointments that we need done so we thought we would just glow ourselves up. We just thought we would take you guys along with our little we appointments just, and our biggest appointment which is our hair appointment. Yes. We which, have been getting so many comments lately about how Olivia is about to go to an appointment so that's why she's in a rush but we have been getting so many comments lately about how we look so alike. Even people like approaching us in the street. Just me. Well Olivia's gone <laughs> Olivia's gone there quite a few times. Literally but, just me. I've had like quite a few people come up to me and be like, oh hi, are you Ashley? Yeah, like, but if anything, no, I'm Olivia. If anything, it should be the other round other way around. I agree. My hair's getting darker, which mm. is looking more like yours. But like And you got rid of your eyelash extensions. Like yeah. you look more like me. <laughs> Yeah, my hair is looking so bad right now. Like, I'm so excited to get it done. It's just so outgrown. Yeah. I'm in a rush, so I'm, like, stuffing my face. But, yeah, we literally have been getting comments all the time saying how we look more alike, which, like, isn't a bad thing. We haven't looked so alike in so long, I feel. Yeah. Anyways, Ashley's going back to her old ways and dying, bleaching her hair. You can't really tell with me because I've got my hair up. My hair's gotten so blonde from just the summer, like, salt water and, like, the sun and stuff. It just goes so blonde. So I'm going back to my old ways and toning it down. I'm trying to tell myself to stop going blonde. I need to stop doing it. Especially when I'm on Ractane, it's just gonna kill my hair even more. But I just can't, I can't bring myself to do it. And like, I don't know, I like looking different. I like looking different. And me it's too. Not, it's not no, like me too. I no. don't wanna look like you, but it's just like, I like, Having that differences. No, I'm so we're kind of, like we're more like, like our own person. Why well, I'm, I'm stuck with this blonde now, and I just feel like I can't get out of it. <laughs> and I'm just you can dye your hair if you want to. You're not stuck like that. But. Yeah, but the thing is, I'm so immune to it now. Like I can't imagine myself with dark hair. Like I've been you blind, literally just look like me. I've been dying my hair blonde since I was like 16. Yeah. So, one day I'll do it. One day. I'll Anyways, do it. I'll we are actually filming this video halfway through our, you know, glow up video because we didn't film the intro but anyways we're going to take you guys along with the video we're going to backtrack to a few of our other appointments yeah hope you enjoy that one so guys ignore the digital show that you can probably hear in the background but our first appointment that we have is getting our brows done because we both need to get them done Ashley is already at the brow appointment and I'm about to go there now but the next clips you see will be us getting our brows done I've had them for over two weeks and I know a lot of people can maintain nails for like a few weeks but me I cannot like mine will last max week. two weeks and they just look so bad so we're gonna go get them done I don't know what I want to get done because lately I've been getting the same white like the same off-white color and I love it but I'm like I should probably change it up so kind of leaning towards black because I've seen this girl on TikTok with like nice long black nails and like I really like the look of it but I don't know Actually, if I suit black nails. I saw a girl on TikTok and she had like this nice brown brownie caramel color so I think I'm gonna get that. Hi! Hi. Hi. Oh, this is the first time you come together. I know, together. I know. <laughs> it actually is. Hi. What would you like today? Can I just get in filled? Can I get these soaked off and then I'll get a new set put on? Yes yeah, sure. Wow, I apologize, our place is a mess because we're in the middle of doing our bedrooms and there's just so much, so much cardboard and stuff. 
that we need to chuck in the bin. But I thought I'd show you guys my nails. So I ended up getting like quite long black. And I got them quite long because the girl that I saw on TikTok who had them, she had them quite long. So it's like inspired. My give yeah. a go. And as I said, they didn't really have the biggest color selection. Like they didn't have the color that I was hoping to get, but I still got this color. And I also ended up getting my toes done. Good morning, guys. So today we're both getting our hair done. And we just thought we'd take you guys along with the day. I'm having a coffee this morning because it's nice and early. It's not bad though. Yes. And then I'm just about to make breakfast and then get ready. So I, sorry about this really random angle. I can't prop the camera up anyway. But I just made some breakfast and I just have my regular oats. I don't know how I'm going to be able to show you without tipping. But yeah, I'm going to quickly eat them and then do my makeup and start getting ready for our hair appointment. I don't want to be running late <laughs> and I really need to start getting ready. So I'm going to eat this really quickly. Hey guys, so we are in the car and on our way to our hair appointment. It was a bit of a rush this morning getting ready because we had we like filmed a few TikToks getting ready and we, we also had to upload post for Beauty Boutique because when we went and shot there a few weeks ago and shot that collection, it's now live. So we had to do a few posts for that. But yeah, we're on the way. We're like 10 minutes away, which is good. And I'm so keen to get my hair done. I feel like it's been ages since I've been at the hairdressers. seeing Alex for? Kind of just today. Today? Yeah, I haven't seen Alex in years. Um, I've been doing Ashley's hair until 2017. <laughs> yeah, but Olivia said I. guys so I apologize for this angle I don't have a good camera set up in my bathroom as well as not very good lighting because it's like down lights so it just casts really bad shadows but I did a little bit of hair treatment shopping today and I got some more Olaplex so I got this one which is number three I have gone through a tub of that before. This time I also bought number zero, which you're actually meant to use first. So I'm gonna put that on my dry hair. Saturate from root to tip, it says, leave on for 10 minutes, don't rinse it, and then apply number three for another 10 minutes, and then have a shower and wash it off. So instead of just doing number three, I'm gonna do them both today and get a really nice hair treatment. And then I've also gone through a tub of this already. And I had to buy another one because it's my absolute favorite and my hair just feels like so soft afterwards and it just makes my hair feel so nice. So we're just doing all we can with my hair and just doing so many treatments. And then I've also got my after shower leave-in treatment, which is the K18, which has incredible reviews. People even said it's better than Olaplex. So many people have been messaging me saying how good it is. So I was like, okay, I have to try it. I'm sold. It's very expensive, but apparently it lasts a while. So I don't know if like using all these different products at once is gonna be a very good idea, but you know when you're just like so excited, you wanna try everything you can. I'm just gonna keep doing this and I'll get back to you guys when it's time for my second application. All right, everyone, I am back and we are doing phase number two, which is number three. And it just says apply a generous amount, so. All right, so I have that in. All right, so I just have my hair slicked back in the treatment and it says just leave on for another 10 minutes. So I'm just gonna leave that on and then I'll probably jump in the shower. So guys, we're going to, we're actually going out this afternoon or this evening for like cocktails with friends and stuff. So we're going to be doing our makeup and I normally do a very, very boring basic makeup look like, I wouldn't say it's boring, but like it's just very basic. 
So I really wanted to try and spice things up a bit, but I really need to buy new makeup because I literally hold on to my makeup for like a year or so. And I don't really like venture out and get cool makeup. I just have like my basics. Um, we did want to film our makeup for you guys as a little like updated and makeup routine. Hey guys, so we're doing our makeup now and we thought we would just film a little bit of it. Um, we're going out this afternoon, so um, we haven't really done our makeup on camera yet, so. I'm being risky today and starting with my eyeshadow. But I'm attempting the soap brows, even though my brows are laminated. I don't know if it's because my brows are um, like longer, but lamination never lasts on me. It lasts not even a week, I swear. Yeah, and I also feel like the lamination is like making my eyebrows fall out. So I'm gonna stop doing it for a little bit. I did a little brown eyeshadow wing and I did soap brows as well. I actually have not filled in my brows at all though, which I don't think I'm gonna yeah, do. Look really dark. Yeah, I don't want them to look over the top. This is the foundation I normally use. Oh, actually, I think I chucked it out because it was empty. Um, and I bought more online, but I think it's still in the mail. Yeah, I bought more online too, but I accidentally shipped them to my old address. Anyways, I really like using the It Cosmetics CC Cream Full Coverage. It looks like this, but it's silver. That's my go-to foundation. This one's really full coverage. I actually feel so good about putting makeup on again though. Like, yeah. I don't like feel so worried that I'm gonna get all this clogged skin and like break out. I feel like I can actually like have a bit of fun with my makeup and like do some fun eyeshadows and like put more products on it that like I wouldn't would have been so scared to put on my face before. So I thought it was like super bad for your skin. And then I use this Giorgio Armani concealer. Although it still doesn't seem to cover my dark circles, which we love that. And then I'll use this Clinique Chubby Stick. When have you had that? I've used it for months. Have you never seen me use this? Oh no, I don't usually do my makeup with you. I've literally used this for months. Can I try it? No. Mm -hmm. I literally just oh, like okay. using my soap brow. So, eyelash routine. Everyone always asks for it. Curl the lashes. Yeah, I also bought more of my favorite mascara, but that's also going to my old address, so I don't know if I'll ever get that either. We curl the lashes. And then this is the go-to mascara. It is so good. Like, I literally have... I don't think I'll ever find a mascara as good as that. And your eyelashes will be looking like spiders. So guys, we are all ready and we want to show you guys a little final look update. Also, no one needs these, any of these appointments to feel better about themselves or, you know, anything like that. But these, are, these appointments are kind of just like a part of our monthly routine, I guess. Yeah, Sometimes it's just like a self-care for us. Yeah. We still need to do like just an everyday. Oh, I also forgot, I didn't actually show you guys my hair. I didn't show you guys my hair after I got it done, I don't think. On no, camera. You didn't. Like I showed you me getting it curled and stuff, but I didn't show it when it was done. Yeah. But yeah, I love it. So this dress is very flattering, I feel like. We kind of both want the same vibe. Dress, jacket. The straps on this dress is so weird because they keep like falling down my shoulders. But other than that, it's a cute dress. This has like a scrunch down the So people are going to ask where our dresses are from. I'm pretty sure they're both from Princess Palette. They're Pop. both from Princess Palette. Anyways, we are going to go and we hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Make sure you subscribe because we upload every single week. Except yes, we, we will be getting week. back into it. We just needed a little break. Definitely needed Got our schedule mixed up, and but it was also just like a needed, needed break. break. So we're getting back into it now. And yeah, make sure you subscribe. Follow us on all our social medias. And we'll see you in our next video.